What's going on guys? Welcome to the channel. And today we're gonna to be installing an MBRP cat back exhaust system on a Ford Focus ST. What year is this car? 2014. That was a fun ride. Very nice. The 350Z is no longer a hoist queen. There's space in here, so these two came home, and now we can do fun stuff, like install <laughs> their cat back. So, car's looking good. It sounds, yeah, <laughs> it's gonna sound better with this. This is one of the things about buying used cars, is uh, you buy used work, and also expired work. That's, that's past its expiration date. I don't even know if that was good even from the start, but this cat back bolts on here. That's the stock downpipe right there. And so this is all gonna be fresh. So we're gonna get rid of all this, whatever that is, whatever that is. Your car is just falling all, all, all over the floor. But it's gonna look good. And then all that's left is downpipe up to the turbo and an aftermarket intake. And then you are ready for a tune. Okay, let's get this unboxed. Uh, can I go? Watch those fingers. fingers Your nails. Good. Look at that. Wow. That's like that's like camouflage. That's fancy. We're gonna save that. We're gonna mess with Nico later. <laughs> so we just got the parts laid out here. So that's the piece that bolts up to the downpipe, and it looks like a resonator, and then a muffler, and then that should kick around the rear subframe, and then that kicks down around the rear subframe and then you've got the tips that's Ooh, nice so nice so we're just for funsies before we even get going we're gonna mock these up here just to see what it even looks like roughly how does that look well it's a little off centered yo what's up i'm picky my name's daytona <laughs> those are a little bit off center <laughs> So is, is it a CD like you thought it was? It's not a CD, but kind of looks like one. I mean, we could try and put that in the computer. It would work. Sticker. Yeah, instructions. <laughs> I'm just kidding, we should probably. I don't need those. Okay. All right, now I'm gonna give you a rough breakdown on how to get this exhaust out. Exhaust is easy, as long as you get a socket set. And if you live in Canada, a lot of patience for cauliflower looking bolts, because it really rusts. This gets unbolted here. These are pressed in carriage style bolts. So you just have to get the nuts off on this side. We're gonna to have to cut this out of here because it's all welded in one piece. So maybe don't take this as like a, an OEM tutorial because this has been janked together and so we're gonna rip it out and get that fresh cat back in here what are, you, what are these safety first <laughs> where did you say the fuel line is well a classic case of rusted nut stuck in the socket it's still hot from tanner and his fantastic blowtorch don't film this <laughs> <laughs> Good sound. We have a lot of extensions. <laughs> Nico, the dogs. Oh. Okay. Wow. Ah! Wow. 
Was that, T that, that is a horrible sounding car. <laughs> So if you subscribe to the uh, 2024 season channel, we'll be done cutting this by then. How long you been at this, Tanner? 20 minutes <laughs> of cutting. So here's a question. What? Has anybody thought about where you're cutting it? You don't think about it and then you just hope it works. And if it doesn't work, then, then you just burn the car to the ground. Good thing we got all this safety footwear around here. This is a pre-game show. That's not even a lock nut. Could just run a turn down on it. That's how I did with my neon once. <laughs> we are mostly done. Uh, looking cross-eyed. And uh, the boys are just mm -hmm. Actually, fitting up the tips. That's kind of sick. No. Okay, okay, okay. 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 Fine. If you want to be boring. <laughs> feed it. If you feed it into one another. <laughs> See, then the exhaust you can act, and it's like yeah. more boost. Yeah, it's going to, it's going to, this side will feed into this side. It'll go back in here. Vortex back out resulting in pulling from air from the front of the car resulting in more boost pressure Less boost pressure. I think that's how aerodynamics works That's recycling. That's, that's aerogonomics er, 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 That's a big word. We start working for SpaceX Hey, where's Nico? <laughs> I don't know how to count. I don't know how to use the word fix. But, it um, looks fixed to me. I didn't unfix it. Use some zip ties. Yeah. Yeah, just hold it. Perfect. That's that's not the focus today. Whoa, that's a focus. <laughs> yes. Guys, Good job. Yeah, we know. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's bolt it up. Let's lower this thing down. Still have to do the test. See how it sounds. We don't. Fine. All right, cold start time. All right. Ow, ow. <laughs> I think that'll do the trick. That'll make this exhaust Soon to come. <laughs>